Yep, guys, that's right. Again, another episode of Battlefield 4. Today I'm bringing you a special episode, which is an explanation on how to play the new the game mode Chainlink from Naval Strike, and also showing some pretty great news about Naval Strike. Because of the release of Battlefield 1 in the Christmas, the fall Christmas season, they are starting to put out, they have been starting to put out free DLCs. See, Naval Strike Expansion Unlocked. As you can see right here, it says Naval Strike is now free. So you guys, everyone who plays Battlefield, make sure you guys go over there, check out Naval Strike. Try your best to uh, download it before it's done. This video should be going up mm, a day or two after I found out. But yeah, if you check here, take the fight to the seas in Battlefield 4 Naval Strike. Download it now and keep it forever. While you're at it, destroy one million boats as a community to claim a gold battle pack. If you want to go, if you want to check out the details, go to their website, Road to Battlefield. Anyways, the way you get Naval Strike is you go down to the store option, go all the way down to new items or all items, and then premium fifty dollars, final stand fifteen, dragon's teeth fifteen, and look, Naval Strike free this is also 15 but you do get it for free you did get it for free for a short amount of time sadly I didn't have my channel at that point like I hadn't put anything out yet um, or else I would have also put that out to try and let everyone know anyways try and get naval strike as soon as possible because if you don't or if you don't already have it because it won't be free for much longer I think it's probably gonna stop being free at the end of this month and then it's gonna be dragon's teeth and then in the month of October I believe it's gonna be final stand because I believe they're releasing one DLC per month for free until the release of Battlefield 4 these are also free like no matter what you can get the phantom bow for the Battlefield 4 community operations which is um, it used to be a premium exclusive item, but now everyone can get it. And then you can also get Night Operations, which is a bunch of different game modes on a nighttime, a nighttime map. Anyways, guys, um, that was a pretty long intro, pretty long explanation. But let's launch into multiplayer all the way down to chain link. Oh, no, not chain link. My bad, guys. Um, I think chain link... Yeah, chain link is dragon's teeth. My bad. Carrier assault. So, capture and hold objectives to damage the enemy carrier. When the carrier is open, take out two objectives while defending your own carrier to win. So, basically, because I had to figure this out on my own, as I just launched into it, but now you guys don't have to. What happens is there are three, I think three to five objectives on the map, and you have to hold those objectives... And then, by holding those objectives, you control the, you control the, uh, the mortar, I think. Either the mortar or the artillery or something. And every, I think, once every 30 seconds, that rocket that's on that objective fires into the enemy ship. And what you want to do is you want to hold the objectives, yeah, they're called launchers, until the enemy character, character, until the enemy character <sighs> until the enemy carrier is half health oh wow shoot so I think we just won no was it a was it a straight up tie I think it may have been a straight up tie anyways um Hold on, guys. Sorry. Let me uh, let me turn this down. Basically, the enemy carrier will take damage every like 10, 20, or 30 seconds. I'm not entirely sure what the timing on it is, but you want to try and hold more objectives so that the enemy carrier goes down faster. Once it reaches 50, you'll get a message on screen that says "Prepare to board," and when that happens. You can board the enemy. Oh shoot! You can board the enemy vessel. 
<clears throat> you can board the enemy vessel, and then while you're in there, you have to blow up two objectives. And if you don't want to go through the hassle of trying to do that, you can also wait, just try and use the, um, I'm sorry guys, I'm kind of, my brain. You can use the cap, captured zones launchers, not, well, the launchers will continue to fire on the ship, and that's the alternative way to win, in which once one ship reaches zero, the team, the team with the live carrier wins. I'm gonna go with the assault class, and I'm going to. I think the SR2 is actually. I'm not certain, but I think the SR2 may be a uh, naval strike weapon. I'm gonna use a P90, you guys. P90 with the reflex scope and a laser sight, and, um, let's see, let's do a muzzle break, alright, alright, I'm gonna be in the transpo chopper, I'm on the gunner seat with one of my squad mates as a pilot, let's, oh buddy, rough takeoff, alright, See if I can if I can hit you. Ah, oh, they jumped out. Destroy it. Oh no, buddy, don't crash. Don't you dare crash. Oh man, dude. Dude. Alright, I got one. Oh shoot. Guy jumped out. Got him. There's another guy still on the island, and I don't know exactly where he is, but I do know there is someone. Alright, got him. Okay, we got Objective Delta. Gonna take this new vehicle, the ACW, which, for those of you who don't know, it is an achievement or a trophy, depending on which system you're playing on, to get a kill, a road kill with this weapon. Cool thing about this weapon is it's all terrain. Because it's... Oh, see? I already have the trophy, but that would have gotten me the Killing Me Softly trophy, which is to get a kill with the ACV. I know I saw someone over here. Alright, let's see if we can get... See, got him. So the advantage of... PDWs is I believe that they have the shortest time to kill out of any weapon type, but they have such small clips that taking on enemies, numbers of enemies larger than like two would be hard. Oh shoot, I'm out. I'm out. See if I can find him. Drop him with a rocket. Alright. It's just me on the capture. Alright, got the double. There's another right there. Oh shoot, that's an RCB. Oh shoot, he just got me with an impact grenade. Man. I'm sorry guys. Well. Yeah, it's it's really it's an interesting It's an interesting game type. Um I really enjoy it. And basically you just wanna you always wanna hold the majority. Oh, did you see that guys? You see that, you guys? It's crazy. It's absolutely insane. Alright, see if I can spot this guy. Ooh, and I'm out. Look at that server lag. 
have shot him up and no. Didn't do anything for the longest time. Alright, hopefully one of my buddies spawn on me. Especially now that I'm taking Charlie. Something else I'm also hopeful for is the fact that no one spots me and snipes me. No one spots me and kills me dead. As you can see, guys, right now we have the advantage. We still have two more health than the enemy does. And now someone spawned on Charlie. Alright, I see him. I figured my small would have taken him out, but alas, the Helio had only a little bit of health left, but it was health nonetheless. Alright guys, oh, spawned on the camper over here, I'm not saying he's doing bad, I'm just saying it's a camper nonetheless. Alright, it's another, I think that's the same chopper. Okay, good. Someone got that guy. Oh shoot. They killed all my squad mates. Let's see if I can get some sneak action going here. Alright, well. I think I got a kill assist. But, you know, that's fine. Stuff happens. I like how the enemy carrier is the is where both of our objectives are. Wow, it took an entire Oh my gosh, the RGO impact. Oh my and he teabagged. You're really not that great, kid. You just got a lucky grenade. I'm diving. Hopefully he doesn't know where I am. No, if I spot him, he probably does. Oh, there are three of these. I'm gonna... And that's how you take them out. That's how the cookie crumbles, boys. Three, four enemies down, actually. I believe that was. And that's how you defend. Oh no, the take the taking Delta, you guys. We ought to take Delta back. Can't lose Delta. Let's see if I can find the guy who's here. Like I like the the water aspect of the, of these of the carrier assault levels. I think they're really cool. Okay, now there's more than two of us here. Oh, shoot.
Got him. Fall out of the sky. No! Someone jumped out and destroyed me. Oh, guys. Alright, good. Someone took out the pilot or the gunner. Oh, hey, look. Top of the leaderboard. Um, here, I'm in on, in on a friendly chopper. I think it's piloted by actually one of my squad mates. Alright, so I'm not the only, I'm not the only blue here. Okay, I want to know how he killed me with a shotgun when I was shooting him in the face. And also, why is why is it on burst fire? You guys saw it here, folks. Shotgun OP. Let's get get those repairs going. Oh yeah. Warning. Warning, because you might go blind. Get out of here, mate. You're gonna get shot up. Okay, I'm out. Sorry. That's not gonna make it. Not even a hit marker. Alright. Picked it up, guys. The mini grenade launcher. Out here first, guys. That guy almost road really killed me. And of course, he was waiting with the SAR 21 on the beach, guys. Man, him versus me, huh? Alright, guys, we gotta defend this objective. We're not gonna take it. No, we're not gonna take it. We're not gonna take it anymore. We got the right to choose, and we ain't done a thing to lose it. Now we aren't gonna take it anymore. Yep. I know that song. Gotta watch Charlie and we gotta watch Delta guys. They can have Echo all they want. But that Charlie Delta life, that is ours. You gotta know. You gotta know you guys. Alright, so there are some here. We've lost two soldiers already. Like, I'm saying it like I'm some sort of professional. Why? Why is it? Oh my gosh, guys. Alright, well, that's that's good. We are preparing for boarding. That's, well, shotgun. Again. We're preparing for boarding, you guys. That means we gotta try and get on board, try and destroy a few objectives. Seeing if I can take the uh, choppy um see I'm touring guys you know, I'm gonna go to Charlie I'm gonna help out oh shoot wow that is quite painful West? Okay, that's behind me. <sighs> Alright, guys. Neutralizing Charlie. Is the carrier open? I think the enemy carrier is open. Hit. 
26%. They're going back to defend the vessel. Dang it! He got me with the SR2, you guys. Oh, man. Yep, there's my teammate. I saw him sneaking up. Our carrier is breached, you guys. We gotta take back the lead. We got the right to choose, and we ain't gonna think to lose it. We ain't gonna take it. Man, I got killed even though, he, like, there's no way he could have seen me. Lame. Whatever. Hopefully we can get a chopper and we can board the vessel. I'm gonna say that's a no-go. Take an ACV. Try and be sneaky and get over there. Guys. Guys. We've armed one of their objectives, but they have all three. Our carrier is open, you guys. This is not a good sign. Alright. Alright, we destroyed objective Alpha. We're preparing for the final assault, but they, they armed ours. If we can get there in time, guys, we can win this. The front of the carrier should be open. I should be able to drive right in. One second! Guys, I'm getting hailed. Oh, this is, this is crazy. Yeah, I'm able to drive right in. Okay. Alright. Alright, guys, I'll only be able to make one episode of this. I have to finish this now. Next time I die. Oh, boy. Save someone. Hey, Mom. Just gonna finish up this match. Guys, can we get it? Can we get the win? I think... I think they're coming, too. No, 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 no. If they disarm the objective, we lose. No, they disarmed the objective. Guys, they're gonna have the... They got the advantage. They have the advantage, guys. We need to... We are gonna win. We need to disarm Bravo now. Can I get through? I can't get through. No! Oh, guys, we're so close. Anyways, that was today's episode of Battlefield 4, and I'll catch you guys next time.